What's up everybody? Welcome to the first introduction of XHTML. For those people who don't know what XHTML is, it's the language that they use to create websites with. In other words, if you know what XHTML is and you know how to use it, then you're going to be able to make websites. And for those of you who have learned HTML or are wondering what it is and if it's the same thing, um, it kind of is and it kind of isn't. HTML is an old language that they used to make web pages with, but now they made XHTML. It's a lot better and a lot newer, and actually, in a little bit, HTML isn't even going to be around anymore. So, this is the new language that they use. And um, for those of you who still don't really understand what it is, uh, I'll try to explain a little better. In order to make a website, you don't just make a bunch of pictures and words and put it down like a text document you actually have to make a code that uh, the browser can interpret see the browser doesn't see a web page like me and you see it what it sees is this a bunch of code like this that it interpret and all the pictures and all the text on it is interpreted and that is what it sees so if you go to view source on any web page then it will show you the code that we actually are going to be making and these tutorials are actually going to teach you how to create this code and what it all means and all that so if you want to know how to make sweet websites then you're in the right place so let's get started um, the first thing you're going to need is something called a text editor and chances are you already have one on your computer if you have a PC you can go to start programs accessories and you have notepad um, this is one that you can use it's a pretty basic one but I would highly recommend using a program called notepad plus and this is what it looks like and if you want to know how to get it then all you have to do is type in www.download.com and when it says search type in notepad and this is all free and it should be the first one on the list right there notepad 475 and you just downloaded it and follow download it then follow the instructions and once you have it downloaded you should have this and it should be ready to go and like I said it's all free but the only thing you need to do is download it so once you got that downloaded you're ready to go and we're ready to start making websites so in the next video you're going to be creating your first website I just wanted to give you an introduction of how browsers see the websites first and um if you're not already there you can go to www.thenewboston.com it's my website and it's where i'm going to be posting all these videos and i'm going to be giving you a step-by-step -step instruction on each one of my videos and it'll help you follow better along with if you like thanks